about today's video, you guys, a challenge I've been wanting to do for so long, and that is a teen room on a budget. And oh my gosh, we are going to do it today. Thrift store shopping, upcycling, you name it, we're gonna do it, and we are going to transform this room from like little girl, brightly colored, to like minimalist, black and white, TikTok-y sort of inspired, everything for this teen girl. So thank you so much Simply Safe for sponsoring today's video. It is the time of year for their biggest sales, so we will be diving into that more later in the video. So we're doing Isabel's room. She is a freshman in high school and she has just a total little girl's room right now that she decorated when she was a little girl and she is now 18 and wants it to be completely different. We've got to head over to Isabel's house, diagnose the room, see what we're doing, and then go shopping. I'm so excited. So we are in Isabel's room. Now, if you look around here, it looks like a young girl's room, right? Well, Isabel is now a freshman in high school and she wants this room to be kind of black and white, minimalist, hip, teenager room. She's a teenager now. Okay, so let's talk about what we have in here that we can repurpose because $300 does not go far. We have this lofted bed. It's got like a desk, the bed up there. These are fine for space saving, but what I don't love about these is it actually makes a room feel smaller. You've got the bed all crunched up to the ceiling. Like if she had some, you know, high ceiling room, these loft beds work, but like in here, it just makes it kind of feel like a cramped dorm. I'm thinking that the plan could be, can we use some of the materials from this old bed to make a desk? Because she wants that minimalist kind of black and white hip, look she is a budding artist enthusiastic about her creativity which i love so we're gonna celebrate that she's also got other artwork to pilfer through so i'm gonna pick some that kind of work with the color palette those flowers are cute taking them away not her vibe anymore we've got some blinds on the wall which they're kind of dirty and they don't match the sheet <laughs> that's over on this wall so hopefully we'll be able to get her some curtains with our budget i feel like this little area here that she set up is sort of her like first attempt at making it more of an adult space in here so i really like that side table that's totally the style that she likes so this light fixture is like a little shiny and glam so i think we should repurpose this maybe take away the blingy aspect of the crystals and spray paint it a different color to kind of be in the more, you know, sleeker, streamlined look. So, gotta go find Joey. We're gonna go shopping. I also have my little sister, Tess, who you guys know. She's gonna be helping us out on this project because we have this to do. We have the parents' bedroom to do. We have so many projects coming up. So she's just gonna be joining the team in a more present way, which I'm so excited about because I love her and she's very talented and she's really good at DIY. So, everyone's lucky. Let's go shopping. Okay guys, we are about to head to the thrift store. We're going to the Goodwill, one of our favorite places to shop. We've gotta get some cute accessories and stuff for her there. Black and white aesthetic, things to organize her art supplies. Another really exciting thing we decided, Joey and I were talking and we thought that this room would be such a perfect opportunity to use one of our new Mr. Kate beds. It is the moon bed, it's so pretty. It's upholstered, it has storage underneath, which will be perfect for her. So we are going to go pick up the full size moon bed from our warehouse and I'm so excited about it because you guys know our on a budget is usually under 300, but using this bed would technically, I mean, we're giving it to her, but we technically put the budget over 300, but all of our furniture line is so affordable and the full size in particular is obviously one of the most inexpensive size options. So no matter what, this will be an on a budget. And then of course we're shopping everything else like clearance and thrift store. I'm so excited. We're gonna get to use one of the beautiful moon beds. It's so cute. So anyways, let's go shopping. Look how early we are to the store. We're the only ones in here. Look, more turn off over here. Oh, I like this one. Oh, and it's nice and long. Look at this marble vase thing. Do we like this? Do we need any hat? Oh my god. I was joking, but. <laughs> she really wants that, like, 
type organizer thing, which I think we give her that look with like a curtain rod. We Have some like hats hanging style, on it. Like a hat on it. And yeah, this one's actually cute. Yeah. Cute? Yeah. Oh, throw pillows. <laughs> okay. What? You know that we never had this moment. Here, it's, here, it'll here, fit here. you. No, this will fit you. It'll here, fit you perfectly. It and this is the wedding that Joey always dreamed of having. Here we go, and the big reveal. <laughs> I do. <laughs> this one's black and gray and really soft. Okay, we definitely still need some like cool accessories. So let's keep looking for black and white, like streamlined kind of. So, definitely you should get her some beautiful new sheets. <laughs> this is like exactly the pattern in like one of her pinned images. I wonder if we get this jacket and use it, like do like a pillowcase instead of this one. Cause like this one's black and white, but it's kind of like, you know, Moroccan. Hey Moon, that's backstage. You can't go back there. That's for the employees. color to go from little girl bright turquoise to sophisticated teen very very light gray. Come around this way. This way. This way. Yeah. There you go. Wow! Good job, Moon. Okay, now go paint, go paint your eye test. <laughs> oh, bless you. Oh no, it's sneezing with a paintbrush. <laughs> This is also zero. We've all been tested for COVID, and it's zero POC So it's just a dust sneeze. Oh, he's out. Painter out. Frame. I almost think that I want to cut the ball to Marco. Like, yeah, the... I got these just in case we don't like them. Yeah, yeah. All right, so just so you guys are aware, I raised Tess. She's always been my protege, <laughs> for better or worse. I was worse. replaced by Moon. <laughs> okay, so let's talk about the projects. We have her artwork here. We should probably take out this. Damask oh yeah, that's a good surround idea. and just use the frame. We're trying to use the artwork that works within the color palette so that we really give her like what her inspiration images were, which is that like black, white, neutral kind of minimalist vibe. And then the good thing is she's an artist; she can create new stuff that works, you know, inspired yeah. by the room and hang it on the system that we've got to work on. So we got that curtain rod at the. Goodwill, the big long one, which will stretch across that whole wall where like the windows off to the side. Hang curtains on the one side and then let the rod extend over and become kind of our sort of like picture rail for then this like gallery setup that we want to do that's actually going to be hanging on chain 
It's gonna be interesting. We're gonna kind of have to finagle like with wire. And then with this, we're gonna try to take off the fabric because this is obviously like a super old school looking lamp as is. I think the base is, is fine that it's old school if we spray paint it a matte black, which we're also gonna spray paint the overhead fixture. And then Tess idea is to take the white twine and maybe try wrapping that around just the frame, which I think could look cool. I don't know, it's one of those things. We don't, we know. don't know, we're gonna try it. We don't know. If it we got two of these. I'll blame it on jelly. Great, that's what I do. Oh, and then you thought, which I think this is a cool idea, Tess thought maybe we do like a splatter paint on this hat which this hat, we've yet to fully decide if we're giving this to Isabel. <laughs> Tess and I are still... Fighting over who looks better. Fighting <laughs> over who should keep it. I'm gonna go work on the triangle painting over oh, her okay. bed. So I'll talk to you guys about that in the room. But yeah, I'm gonna paint, I'm gonna go paint her wall. Sweet. Sweet. Sweet, bro. Ouch! <laughs> Ouch! In the meantime, we're gonna hang this really pretty one. This is a original artwork by Isabel. There were tacks in here attaching it to the wall, but since we need to attach the cable, what I'm thinking is we can kind of double tack it. got still more to do obviously in Isabel's room. I thought it would be the perfect time to tell you about our sponsors, Simply Safe. You guys have heard us talk about them before. They're an amazing company, awesome products. So, let's dive into some awesome details about Simply Safe. Okay, so as we all get ready for the holiday season with feasts and celebrations and family, it's good to be aware that there is almost always a risk of break-ins during the holidays, which is why Simply Safe is having their best sale of the year right now. Simply Safe is one of our favorite smart home companies that offers everything you need in home protection with their super simple system that you can easily install in under an hour that includes door and window sensors, glass break and motion detectors, and a smart base station that connects it all. Simply safe on home. In addition to the basic accessories, you can also add smoke alarms, carbon monoxide alarms, and water sensors to protect your home from more than just burglaries, as well as indoor and outdoor cameras and smart HD video doorbells that can all be accessed from the Simply Safe app. One of my favorite things is their simple key fob. So you can turn your alarm off and on on your way in and out of your house, just like you would unlock and lock your car. And of course, my very favorite thing is how easy it is to set up for literally anyone just right out of the box. And the best part about this alarm system is that it's for everyone, owners and renters alike, because it's easy to install with removable adhesive strips. So when you need to take it down, it's super easy. Simply Safe will be offering a variety of holiday discounts throughout the holiday season. So make sure to check out simplysafe.com backslash Mr. Kate to check out all of the Simply Safe holiday deals. It's simple, you just place your order online and everything shows up on your doorstep ready to be installed by you. And they have 24 seven professional monitoring so you can relax and enjoy your holidays knowing you've done more to protect your house, your belongings and your loved ones. Thank you for watching and thank you Simply Safe for sponsoring. How good does this wall color look? It's like so different than what she had before. I feel like just even doing this completely makes it more of a sophisticated adult space for our teen, our freshman Isabel. So now we're gonna do something that will be very budget friendly because all it is is some tape and a quart of black paint. Um, doing some kind of like geometric shape. I want it to be like one big triangle and a little bit smaller and then a little bit smaller, but I don't want them to be like perfectly symmetrical. I want there to be some asymmetry to it. 
which will look cool, plus it's a lot easier and faster to do. our trick which you guys have heard us do this before but you paint over the tape with your base wall color first and then go over it with your whatever contrast and color that you actually want to paint your stripe and the reason for that is you'll just get a much crisper line because whatever is going to bleed under the tape will be the color that already matches the wall color Okay, so here we have a ladder. You might recognize it from Isabel's bunk bed. We were looking at it and thought, you know what, it's actually kind of like a cool thing and could be fun to have in her room. We gave it a quick fresh coat of the wall color so it'll just like really blend in nicely. And then taped off the rungs with just this kind of like stripe. Gonna just paint a black stripe on this. So just like more geometric stuff, minimalist, black and white, yas, let's do it. What an awesome freeway to update. This is Moon's first time in the rain. Yeah. First time being. You want to go in the cockpit? Let's see. Yeah, it's raining. Look, look. Can you feel it? Let's see the trees are drinking the water. Yeah. Can you put your can you put your mouth open and catch some water? Does <laughs> move? You're singing in the rain. Moon singing in the rain. <laughs> okay. I'm blown out. I'm in Isabel's room and we are just doing some of the artwork. What I'm gonna do with you guys right now is I'm going to make that pillow for the bed. So Kate picked up this kind of Moroccan y, like glammy pillow. She also got this plaid flannel jacket. I don't know what it is. But I am gonna attempt my skills on the sewing machine.
with the lamp that is now beautifully matte black, totally tying in with our color palette. I ended up spray painting the white thread that I wove around here black as well, just because I thought it was just a cleaner look to have it all black. Plus, it totally ties in the overhead fixture that is now spray painted matte black and looks so cool and different than like the glam existence that it had before. So, yay, dust glam. Workouts, which lately she's been doing over zoom with her grandparents which is so cute so she had these weights in here and her yoga mat and I made sure that the floor plan left this whole area right here by her mirrored closet nice and free so she can still do her workouts and have space so I think that over here we'll just do like a cute little setup like I found these boxes as you guys saw at the thrift store super inexpensive this is also our beautiful marble pot that we found which I was looking at it and I was like wait is this like the cutest yoga mat holder ever <laughs> it fits so perfectly and it holds it so I feel like this little cute collection of boxes over by her closet we'll put her weights up here Boom. Which actually her weights are like so aesthetic. They're like rusty. <laughs> they look very vintage. You know this cute little purse that she had up here. All right, she already had this tray table and her little like chair set up over there. It's perfect as a side table. Our thrift store lamp looks so cool with the cork base. And then I just put a filament bulb here, which just looks cool because like filament bulbs you can have just exposed. It's very much that like minimalist vibe. We'll put it in back there. Oh my gosh, this is such a really awesome moment for me to see one of our designs in a space we've never used this bed before in a room so it just is really cool to see it and i really hope that isabel loves it and i love that we've been able to give her so much storage underneath too i'm just so excited i think it looks so good what do you guys think <laughs>
huge before and after, obviously starting first and foremost with the wall paint with our beautiful super, super, super light gray. And then I love how the triangles turned out asymmetrical over here repurposing the ladder from her old bunk bed. It's just like a very sculptural moment here. And then, oh my gosh, her art just celebrated on that wall. Looks so good. And then the chain hanging down to display her art is just so cool. The desk, it's a perfect homework desk now. Before the desk was built into the loft bed and felt very like, it was like a little hobbit desk felt very small and crunched in there. So now it's open and clean. We accessorized with our thrift store finds. I love how everything looks over there. We repurposed obviously the metal chair that she had in here for her desk chair because her other one was broken. And then over here just her exercise equipment, which is something she likes to do, so it's perfect. She's got a nice amount of floor space here still. Overhead light fixture made such a difference, just painting it out black. Like that plus our little web desk lamp are now like a really cool pair that play off of each other. So we really did it on the budget. Like I just think it looks really nice and finished and complete. So now comes the time to get Isabel in here. I think Joey and I are gonna social distance maybe outside the window so Isabel can come in here and see her new room. So let's go get her. All right guys, so. Christine and the family are in the backyard. They just got here. We're gonna go um, get Isabel to show her her room. We're gonna go out there masked up. They're masked up, but we've all had tests. They just got tested. Yeah, too. and then when we bring them in, we're gonna go outside and watch through the window. Hello, family! Whoa! The whole squad's here! Are you guys smiling? Yeah, <laughs> okay. <laughs> are you excited? Yay, us too. Okay guys, we're in the window. So Isabel can come in the room. She's gonna be over there, we're here. All right, Isabel, are you out there? Yeah. One, One two, two, three. three. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, it's so good. You wow. It's so different than your room was before. It is before, really right? different. It's so cute and oh my gosh. You were the first one to own a Mr. Kate moon bed. Yeah, this is one of, from our furniture line. That's so cool. Yeah, and it's got storage drawers on the bottom so you oh, have lots so of nice, nice storage. And obviously that desk was, we salvaged one sort of section of your bunk bed. You still got have all the floor area in front of your mirror, which is obviously nice to have that. And then obviously we were so inspired by the fact that you're an artist. So we wanted to have like a super cool way for you to display your art. Look at your up overhead fixture. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Right? All right, so do you want to show your parents or you don't care? We, do we need to show our parents? Yeah, no, I think you're, you're, maybe your mom and dad can come in. Three, two, one. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Whose room is this? This is crazy. This is amazing. Look at this bed. Oh my gosh, and your desk. Oh, I love, I love the art. plant. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. And your workout stuff is here. Oh. Isabel, look at that. And you wanted something geometric. Oh my gosh, and the head is so cute. Cute. And the art, you can add things. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. <laughs> I love your narration, it's perfect. Oh my gosh, it's so, you're seeing all the things. Oh my, you guys are amazing. Oh, thank oh, you. Seriously. Yes. Yes. Oh my so gosh, do you love it? Yeah. She, she, she was doing a little clap. So. Yeah. But here's the thing, we also did your guys' room. What? <laughs> Oh, that's okay. Yeah, uh, that is amazing. Oh, I can't wait. All right, you want to go see yours? Yeah, totally. Right. You guys got to wait till the next episode. Yeah. But uh, we're going to go show them that, so make sure you're subscribed if you aren't already. Because you'll want to get that notification, because obviously they're excited. We got to go 
find their window to peek through now. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. You guys are not gonna wanna miss this next episode. Make sure and hit that subscribe button, turn on your notifications. We are going back to Isabel's house where we are making over her parents, Christine and Ben's master bedroom. It's a complete surprise and a massive challenge. We're making over the entire space by only shopping at the dollar store. And also, huge thanks to Simply Safe again for sponsoring today's episode. Make sure and check that out, simplysafe.com backslash Mr. Kate. You can check out all of their amazing holiday deals and you'll keep your home safe. You guys, we love you. We'll see you soon. Stay creative, stay weird, stay you. One, two, three. Whoa. <laughs>